What is up guys, Kelsen here, and welcome back to the next road trip. We are right where we left off in the last episode, ready to just keep on clearing out this hospital as best we can with ETH. So, while we're walking over there, let me show you his stats. As I said, we are on the same day of 1 month, 15 days, 19 hours. Weight is going down now, slightly. We have killed 3,207 Zeds. We have killed quite a few. <laughs> but yeah, we're going to go back over to that main entrance side. Yeah, this is the emergency lane here for the ambulances to go right into the emergency room. That makes more sense. Move that over. I think this might as Yeah, this is my last... Uh, bottle of beta blockers, so we might have to be wary about that. But we can rest up here before we head in. Okay, nice, we're good. Rain is, I think, getting a bit stronger than what it was in the last episode. Hopefully it doesn't get too bad. But Keith is still going strong with the machete, though. Look at that. I could also do wield. I think I might do that. Look at that. If you had two machetes, I know we do at home, I think. That would be very cool. Alright, let's see what's going on over here. Yeah, they should still be trying to migrate to the corpses, I think. And there's Spear Lady. Another one, I think. Spears are actually quite nice. I don't really think it cares about your level on them. Spears are just very good. Except for the little animation lock that they do sometimes. You gotta be careful about that. But other than that, they're pretty good. Let's get the shotgun out for this. I don't want to risk this. I don't like the lag. Another cop or a ranger of some sort. Reload and then get the shotty out. The shetty, machete, whatever. Same thing. I like making up nicknames. Gunshare blade. Hmm. I'll keep it. Might be able to use it. Who knows? Probably. Duffel bag, cologne, don't need. You've got enough of them. Yeah, look at the little carpet of Zeds we got coming out here. Oh, you're trying to flank me. I see you. Trying to pull some advanced tactics. Right back into the action, it seems. Very nice. Machete might go. Hopefully it doesn't, I think. Yeah, we can repair it if we get some duct tape or something, I think. You know? What does the most here? Other oh, strips, really? How oh, many tailoring four? Ah, oh, well. If we get tailoring four, we can really do it quite easily. I think that's a that's new to the mod. Or some mod. That wasn't there when I put it in the early days of the series, I don't think. Is that what it is? A shiv? No, it's a bed knife. Of course it is. It's always a bed knife, no matter what. Yeah, this machete's gonna go. I can feel it. I feel it in me bones. Oh, we're getting surrounded a little bit. Back off. Don't know where y'all are coming from. Coming from somewhere. That's all I know. Somewhere down there. Is that the southeast? Alright, shoddy time again. 42 shells remaining. Try to get the most out of it. Oh, right click, don't do it. Please don't start with me. Don't start with me, right click. Seriously, don't do it. I was about to shoot this guy in the face. I don't want to do that. You're right here. Can I get you from here? Can't. That sucks. Someone's munching. Where are you? Kind of hard to see them when they're munching. Especially in the pile of corpses like this. There we go. Nice. Right through the head. Get you as well. What else we got? Looking good. I just want to take a screenshot real quick. This is this is kind of a milestone. I'm going to show this off. Uh, and then, bam. That's good enough. Uh, I could do better. Hold on. I just want this to go away. But it won't because of the keybinds. There we go. That works. Hopefully one of those is good. Might use them as a thumbnail too. That can actually be pretty nice, but... 
a little be some behind the scenes action for y'all. Trying not to cut anything because this is just gonna be madness through and through. It is 4 p.m. We do got to be wary about the time. Get you. Come on. Oh, there we go. Looks like we cleared out the main lobby. I'm not too sure about the second or third or fourth floor, but main lobby's clear. We didn't need to burn it. That's very nice. Let me just see. How much is our sneak level going off? Because that is actually a good way of seeing how many are around. It doesn't seem to be going up at all. Uh-oh. Let's get back out of here. It's a little bit of sneakage. There we go. Break their ankles. If they weren't broken already. Coming out then. All four of you. Beta blockers seem to have worn off. I'm gonna need a smoke as well. Okay. Smoke first. There's no cigarettes? Oh, there. Okay, I gotta unpack them. Alright. Beta blockers then. We can worry about the smoking later. Beta blockers in panic. You need to worry about that first. Always. Nice. Very nice. Good job, Keith. She can't, apparently. It is cool that they speak sometimes. It does add a little bit more to it, I think. The experience. Okay, cigarettes. Unpack one. She gave me 20 more. Yes. Have a little smoke while they walk towards me. Another shotgun for me. I see you. Nice. Come on, then. And a little bit of the shook action. Here we go. Another M500. I will unload. And then, where'd you put it? Right there. Rack it. Drop it. I don't want to carry any more weight than I have to right now. How many shells do we have? We have 41. So we can take out a few groups. If we need to. But we're going pretty good with melee only right now. As long as they keep up at this rate. Not too sure how many are left. It's really just the other floors I'm worried about. I can deal with the first floor. Other floors are going to be a hassle. I can definitely hear them above me. I don't want to move forward when they come down these stairs. That'll be that'll be bad. But I think it's open enough where I'll be fine if I go this way. I was hoping the claustrophobia doesn't kick in. I want to check out what's in here though. This place looks like a little shop. Let's see. What have we got? Oh, one behind me. I see you. Two behind me. Where'd you come from? Stairs? That's what I'm guessing. Yeah, they're coming down the stairs. They can hear me above. That makes no sense, but okay. That's just the way Zomboid works. Coming from outside? Hmm. Strange. How are they following me in from outside? They just kind of seem to be peering out of nowhere. I don't know. I know they aren't, but it's just kind of what it seems like. Alright, let the group down. Eight minutes in, how many kills we got? We've got like 200 kills. That is insane. I love this game. Oh, do it again, Keith. Come on. Here you go. You shoved instead of killing. Where are you going, sir? Are you going to the corpses? Oh, both of you. <laughs> that guy was like, what was that? I heard something. Let me turn around and get my face chopped up. Alright, can I see what's in here now? Thank you. Ooh, it's all food. Okay. Hold on, let me put on the proxy. I'm gonna take all the good stuff. Jar of chocolate wafer sticks. Hmm. That sounds delish. But I don't need it right now. I need all the good stuff, all the big things. Jocks! Good to see you. I will take you. And a bear. Why not? Dead rat, I'm not taking you. <laughs> Uh, what else we got? Take a little gift shop, I guess. There we go. More magazines to read. Always nice. Coloring book. Anything else? 
if the fire gets up, Batman Spiffo, give me that. Freddy the Fox, it's Foxy the Fox, but okay. I'll let you go. I'll let you go with that. Okay, let's get out of here. He's like my claustrophobia is kicking back in, or Keith's claustrophobia, I should say. We need to eat. Have some chocolate. I did not mean to sprint. That's my bad. Because how my keybinds are. Eat the rest of that. Get our hungry out the way. Wait, you're still going down. That's fine. Alright, come on. Are you a sir? I think, yeah, you're a sir. Couldn't tell, but... Found out in the end. They are still coming down these stairs, which means there are still a lot of them right there. I could yell. That'll probably get them all down. Which I might do. Let's do it. Let's yell once. See what that does. Speed up time a bit. Not one of those men. Somewhere. Can't really tell where. Ah, uh, here we go. It did work. Nice. Come on then. Yeah, if they come down like this, this'll be this will be fine. Okay, maybe okay, hold on, hold on. This hold on. Hold on. I say that and then they all come down the stairs at once. Let's get the shotty out. We can deal with this though. That's what the shotgun's for. We good? How are we doing? I feel like my voice is going away a bit. Which makes sense. I am recording this right after the last episode. So I would be I wouldn't be surprised. Come on, I see you. You see me. Let's get this over with. There we go. Is that door unlocked? No, let's do that. Just in case. Nothing in that. I'm gonna leave my proxy on for now. This is a lot of tailoring levels. That is very nice. I hear you. I'm bunk. Okay. Oh, no, some more. I'm gonna try to kill as many as I can that come down these stairs. Because once I go up there, I'll have to be on my A game. I'm gonna be in my S game, actually. Because they are they are on all sides of the stairway, I think. That's what it sounds like. I don't even know what this is. This is like a I don't even know. I really don't know. Where is the fire? That's what I'm worried about. Where where is the fire at right now? Because I'm pretty sure the thing is actively still going. But also, maybe not. Maybe the rain actually put it out. We might have actually saved the hospital. It's definitely gonna need a bit of rebuilding, but Half of the hospital still stands. And the main doors are still up. Well, not the doors themselves, but you get what I mean, right? Cafeteria is here. We actually made it to the other side. Hello, you. It is kind of dark. I didn't bring my light because that thing just wakes me down and I never use it. Bunk. I'm hearing them munching all around. I don't like it. Not one bit. The vending machine is still up. There is bacon in that vending machine. I'll take the pickles, though. Bacon's rotten. Hello, guys. Come on. What are you stuck on? I can't tell. I don't like this. Come on. There's nothing there. What are you doing? I'll just shoot you. you little goobers. Getting stuck on air. I didn't see what you. I see the one behind me at the window. Gotta use your peripherals. Very useful. Man, look at that. We have free exit right here. Alright. Yeah, the rain is starting to come down heavy. I think the thunderstorm might be in the next day or two. Look at that. The ashes are going away now. Nice. We are exerted. 
Let's head back to the RV. Don't hop over the fence. Let her just use more stamina. Hello. Another spear for me. Thank you. Scrap shiv spear. Okay, nice. Let's put away this stuff. We got some visitors up here as well. I see you. You see me. Time to get it over with. Goodbye. Everything good up here? Oh, yep. I could take the time to burn these corpses. That's not a bad idea, now that I say it out loud. But I'm going to leave that for another time, I think. That'll probably be the last thing we do. Just get all the corpses burnt so that this place is actually secure. Uh, it's not good for now. By the way, the spears. There we go. Nice. Have a bit of a rest. Stay here for a couple of minutes. Boom. Yeah, rain is starting to pour. We've got a few hours left before we have to call it quits for the day. Check it the, take a look at the kill count. 3,300 Zeds killed. One month, 15 days, or 16 days now, almost. One hour remaining. Favorite weapon is still the crowbar. Wait, he has gone up, but it's also going down. Actually, no, it's still going down. Never mind. We have to worry about that. Actually, yeah, we do have to worry about that. Because if that gets down below 75, we're not going to be good. So, let me eat this. Just to try to flatline it for now. We're going to burn a lot of calories doing this anyway, so we got to be a little bit more on top of that. And good night. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I think I'm going to just periodically check that. There's the morgue right there. I see that. Well, I see you out here, actually. And you. Come on, then. Take a look at my frames real quick. That's pretty smooth. Here at this type of place. 50 frames. It is getting smoother since all the ashes and blood are gone. We're doing pretty good. Keith is surviving. I don't know if I could have done this if he only had one arm. I'd be real honest about that. It's unfortunate that mod broke, but it's also pretty lucky that that mod broke. Because now Keith can actually live on with both his arms still intact. And just have a grand old time. Wait, still flat line. That's good. Okay, I'm just gonna yeah, I'm just gonna periodically check, just in case it starts going down. I think we're good for now though. Okay, you guys are starting to repopulate up here. Can't be having that, no siree. Which way are you going? You going this way? Bop. Oh, almost didn't see you, but I heard you. Yeah, the fire has actually stopped. Come on in. Double push. Oh, there's a drowsiness. Okay. Kill this group and then pull back immediately. Oh, there's two up here I can kill real quick. Three up here, actually. Come on, Keith. Killer. Being human no more. 30 shells remaining. Alright, let's head back home. We're not home, but you know, RV. On an RV trailer, I guess. Words are difficult sometimes. A lot of words for a lot of things. Kill you two real quick. Might have, yeah, I'm gonna check the radio as well. We gotta see when the rain is gonna start. Actually, or the thunderstorm's gonna start. Have a smoke before we head in, though. Alright, let's go. Back inside. Zombies after you? How can you tell, Keith? You got super senses. 
Keith, you really have to get inside that trailer. I don't want to catch you out here. There we go. Alright, let's see. Oh, lag. There we go. Radio. Device. Options. Bam. I can have it on full blast in here because there's nobody able to enter here. Let's have you sit on the bed, Keith. There you go. Uh, we're going to have to wait until 9. Because the, the automatic broadcast is on every hour by the hour. Or on the hour, every hour. Showers, a thunderstorm. I need to know the date. 35 degrees Fahrenheit. Dang, that's very cold. Not very cold, but it's cold, cold. Heavy cloud, no sun. Chance of a snowfall. Please tell me the thunderstorm. Separate failure. What does that mean? Wait, what does that mean? What? Is that, I don't, I don't know what that meant. I hope there's nothing serious. Oh, I just broke Keith. <laughs> Look at that. He's floating. There we go. Fix it. All right. Well, I will go to bed. I'll see you guys when I wake up. I guess now Keith is automatically going to try to punch you. But yeah, I'll see you guys in the morning. Okay, I woke up sooner than I anticipated, and Keith is very drowsy. I need to grab a bottle of bourbon from the trunk. Please die. We are going to have to go back home base, because we are out of beta blockers, which means I can't really sleep in the, in the trailer. Where's my bourbon? One will do, I think. Okay, let me see if I can sleep, and then I'll catch up with you guys in a bit. Alrighty, the thunderstorm seems to have passed for the, the thunder part of the thunderstorm, I guess. It's now just storming. Hmm. Well, I think we will take the rest of this episode just to try to get home. We do have to resupply. So let me see, I'm gonna grab the sledgy. So that we can break through the little fence here. I could probably just disassemble it, but these were metal fences, so I'm not too sure about that. Let me see. Nope, can't do it at all. Never mind. Time to destroy. Uh, I see here. Come on then. There we are. Oh, I can drop that bottle. Don't need it no more. The bourbon did work. Otherwise, we wouldn't really be here right now, would we? Let me see. Destroy. Come on. I don't want to hit you over the head with this legend. Oh, hey, another maintenance. What was that? Durability? That's new. I just kid you. It's just because I hit. What was this? Maintenance level 6. That's cool. Another trait to add to Keith's uh, little, little list there. Not little no more. I'll tell you what. And you were doing that with the machete, Keith. I don't know how you did that. He's just too strong. Too capable. Alright, nice. That's done. Let me see. Yeah, that's still going up at the same rate. We have to redo those levels since he chopped the when you chop off his arm. I'm pretty sure I would said this, but when you chop off his arm, his his strength and his, um strength and strength and fitness also went back down a level. So they both got a ways to go again. All right, let's get out of here. I am also losing my 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 voice and just my overall will to speak. So I would do want to get home so that I can prepare for the next episodes. Oi, there we go. Should be pretty straightforward this way now. That's really the only the only bad part right there is the roadblock. With all the cars. Hopefully this isn't too bad. Okay, it's it's kind of kind of iffy. There is quite a few out here. There's a bat on that guy's back. I saw that. I just want to get home. Home is where I need to be right now. Where Keith needs to be. He needs to rest up in his bed. Not be stuck in some cramped RV. Being terrified of what's in front of him or outside. But sleep. So I, I'll tell you what. Sleeping in an RV trailer when I know there's Zeds that can be outside. That is very terrifying. Because there's only one door out. If there's more than one Zed by that door, I'm screwed. Even if there is one Zed by that door. 
If he's on that door, I might get chomped on my way out. Not fun. But that's Zomboy for you. This is, in fact, how you died. And look at that. We're home. Just took one, one little rant from me. The wind is picking up a bit. Gotta deal with all these corpses again. Oh, it looks like the plants are coming along well. We have been gone a few days, I think. I'm not gonna worry about parking it right now. I just want it in. You gotta smoke first, there you go, Keith. Can't leave the, the vehicle and smoke at the same time. That's just too much brain power. Oh, they're stuck on the crops over here. Let's see what's going on. Is that, they're looking real good. Seed bearing potatoes, nice. Cabbage is going. Broccoli is not ready yet. We're not seed bearing. At least the corn's ready, but not seed bearing. I need seed bearing. Right. I did not mean to do that, but it seems like the tea stays planted, so that works for me. My right, seed bearing. I want seed bearing. Looks like most of them are seed bearing, except for that one on the end there. This one. Nice. Another level in farming. Looks like the tea leaves don't actually have a freshness to them, so that's good for me. Put these back away. Uh, and then we have to put this in here for now. There we go. Okay, let's see what else we can do. Ooh, I can see things now. Let's go. I always thought that this was a mod, but no, if you just what level farm, you might level farming level four, you can just see things. With your eyes. Very cool. There we are. None of this is ready, right? Except for the corn and broccoli. But I need those to be seed bearing. Pack this up. Hey, hey, hey. No, 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 no. Give me that. Back, please. Give me that. Anything else I'm missing? I don't think so. I think that was it. Alright. No. Yes. Okay, yeah, yeah. We're good. Alright, let's go put this stuff away. And then I'll send you guys off. Another successful day. It's good to be home. It really is. But we're gonna be leaving real soon. Go back out there. Let me actually, let me go check out the front gate real quick. How are we looking? Crap. Crap, crap, crap. What happened out here? Is there a Zed on the base? That's a mannequin. Did they just break it and walk away? Yeah, was it you? Did you do it? Or was it your friend back there? What are y'all gonna tell me? I'm gonna torture you for it. I have to. Oh, they didn't give anything up for it. Was it you? I'm telling you, I'm gonna figure it out. Okay, well, I'm gonna have to replace that gate off camera. Bop. All right, let's just get back inside for now. Actually, we have a car battery charger now. I can take this. Oh, Jesus Christ, it was you. You guys did it. Definitely. Well, you guys get the shotgun. Destroy my gate. I don't know why I double pumps. I don't get it. I don't know if I broke something with my settings or not. Yeah, it was definitely them. I don't know where they came from, but it was it was definitely those three. Okay, I gotta worry about that now. I will do that off camera. We got plenty of stuff to do it with. I just gotta go get the wood. Alright, well, let's put this stuff away like I intended to do before we get really interrupted. Here we are. I gotta go check the Jenny. I'll do that off camera. Get plenty of gas to do so as well. Put the potatoes away. I gotta get my weight back up. You know what? Let's eat a couple of these. These are good for weight. Along with the cabbages. Too full? Get weight to not go up. That's fine though. We can deal with that later. I can deal with that later. It's a uh, kind of boring for you guys to watch. 
eat the tea leaves if I want to, but I want to make myself some tea and coffee later. Someday. Once I figure out how to do that. I think I know how. It's just, it's just a cup with water and then you put the coffee when it's heated and stuff. Or you make a cup of joe or something. Alright, well, uh, can I turn the lights on here? I think I can. Yes, okay, well, let's sit down. Have a rest. Keith has been through quite a lot. Let's check out his stats. There we are. Let's see. 76 weight, flatlined. Paper weapon is still the crowbar. 3,354 Zeds killed. Very nice. We have survived for 1 month, 16 days, and 19 hours. Cool. Well, if you like this type of stuff and you want to see more, make sure you hit that like button down below. And consider subscribing as well. It is free. You can unsubscribe whenever. And it helps me out a ton. Well, I'll see you guys in the next episode. Or next video, I should say. Peace.